This is a huge, huge, huge opportunity. The winner gets a shot at that OVW National Heavyweight Championship. Oh my God! Tony Gunn came out of nowhere. The opportunity belongs to Shotgun Tony Gunn. Can he get up there? Oh. And get it! Shotgun Tony Gunn! Well, let me tell you this, James Storm. I am OVW. After tonight, I'm going to be your national champion. Mr. Pectacular. Jesse Goddard. Jesse Goddard. Don't do anything rash. Just give me the key. Goddard. Yes. Goddard. Yes. Man, enough is enough. Jesse, you're a little angry when you're thirsty. So how about you just drink some beer? God, Jesse Goddard just busted that beer bottle. Guys, oh, God, he split him open. Tony. Guys, not only is Tony not down not 100% physically, he can't be 100% mentally after his former best friend Goddard's attacked him in the opening hour here in OVW. Storm side swept out. Oh, oh. 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 Arm and hit a oh. backcracker. Look at this. Look at this God. referee position. Oh, I thought that was it. There. Man. Tony Wait Goddard turns it around, turns it through James Storm into that chair. Oh, look out, he's look out. The champion. We got the champ. Oh, my God. Two. Oh. oh! They call for the kill shot. Wait, 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 wait! What the hell? What, what the hell is Goddard doing out here? Jesse Goddard's with that key. I know it was you back there, Tony. Nobody makes me bleed. Hold on, hold on, Tony Gunn. Shotgun Tony Gunn heard enough. Goddard's bloody gun and, and screwed him out of his championship match. Gunny Goddard's just trying to beat the hell out of each other. Look at roll of quarters. I'm going to do to you what your daddy in Arkansas should have done. Beat you up and kick your bum ass outside. Jesse Goddard's, there's hell that's going to be paid in this Saturday, Jesse. Plainly put, I'm going to beat the ever living <laughs> you, you arrogant son of a bitch. Ladies and gentlemen, from the Brian Fox Band, recording artist, Brian Fox! All right, everybody, how you guys doing tonight? You know why we're here. I want you to join me. I want you to follow me along in just a second. That's right. Click, click, boom. Come on, everybody, want to hear it? Come on. Click, click, boom. Click, click, boom. Come on. We're all here tonight to celebrate Tony Gunn. My man's been bloody and he's been beaten. And he's been betrayed. And he's here to show everybody tonight that he's
You're looking you at the got. best there is. Just Four rolling up your heavyweight champion. Tell us just damn any champion. Yeah, you're looking at the best there is. Yeah, you're looking at the best there is. We're setting up for betrayal. For backstabbing. For a blood feud between Tony Khan and Jessica. What's Tony got here? A little bit of liquid courage. That's good what he does. Drinking whiskey. And kicking ass. And I think he's about to cross one off his lips right now. The feet get on your feet, you're just in time for the show. He shot. In case you don't know, that's the best there is. Look at that, the best there is. Give me all you got, just teach shots to me. Yeah, you're looking at the best there is. Yeah, you're looking at the best there is. Give me all you got. Just keep shots to me. Yeah, you're looking at the best. the intro where the hell is jesse goddard's i i honestly don't know brian I, you guys up top y'all know anything where's jesse it's just the biggest show of the year yeah to come on your own time you figure this is going to be the time when he's going to want to show his face the most all right here we go all right this is it and his opponent from hollywood california mr Pactacular. Jesse Goddard! All right, here we go. I, I know he's here. I, I saw him backstage earlier tonight, guys. He's staying back there. What the hell? Where is Goddard? What is so when I pay him enough, I shine his shoes enough, do we not uh, need his hey, rider? Hey, what the if, hell? If anybody in the back can hear me, hey, somebody tell Goddard's his yeah. match is up. It's it's time. Come on, Goddard's. We got, I don't blame him. I wouldn't want to come out here and get in the ring with Tony Gunn in this state either after what Jesse Goddard's has put Tony Gunn through over the last several weeks. But All right. Oh, Tony's had enough, guys. Tony's going back, and he's going to find Jesse Goddard. Tony in pursuit here. Jesse! Where the hell are you? Goddard's Jesse You guys seen Jesse? Yeah, seen him, man. Where the hell are you? Goddard's Hell is he?
Now we can start. Now we can start. Tony Gunn backstage, a blindsided attack. Jesse Goddard's just lying in wait. What a piece of trash. Jesse Goddard's not wanting a fair fight, wanting to again blindside and cheat. And this is ridiculous. Someone Gun he used to call a friend. Gunn literally never saw it coming. That psychopath, Jesse Goddard's. This crowd chanting, Jesse sucks. You know what? Yeah, Davis Arena, he does. He sucks. Ridiculous. What a horrible excuse for a human being. These two were the best of friends at one point in time, and, and honestly, I just, I never trusted Jesse Goddard's. I never have, and I never will. Josh, I'm embarrassed. I thought he was turning over a new leaf. I thought we were seeing, oh, ooh, a new Goddard's, but now we're just seeing the same old Goddard's, maybe a more dangerous and visceral version. I think we might be seeing the most dangerous version of Jesse Goddard's. Speaking of which, as he pulls those steel steps, What's he got in mind well, here? Guys, you gotta think Jesse was at the top of the pecking order for the longest time, national heavyweight champion for over 500 days. Oh. Not a man who would need to get jealous, but now Tony Gunn got the opportunity he wanted, and you see that jealousy just seeping out of him. Goddard's trying to flip those steel steps, and ladies and gentlemen, unlike some other places, our stairs are close to, I would say, 120 to 150 pounds. It's solid steel diamond plate. It could have decapitated Tony there. I have watched the edges on those stairs slice open superstars for the better part of 15, 16 years since we've had them. Bell finally ringing. Right, the grudge match has officially started. And guys, Jesse Goddard's not starting this matchup on a fair heel here for Tony Gunn. Goddard's obviously wanted that advantage, but also wants to embarrass Tony Gunn. We saw Thursday. Oh, come on, Gunn fighting back into this. We saw Gunn. Thursday Jesse dismantle a former student of Tony Gunn's to embarrass him, but now, look, Gunn, just so much damage oh, already this done. this is completely different. Last week was a student, but this week, oh. Oh, he's got the teacher. There's Preston, Tony Gunn unloading. Tony doesn't give a damn about being technical or pretty. He wants to tear Jesse Goddard's limb from limb. Shots being fired from both men now, just laying into each other. But Tony Gunn just taking too much damage before the bell even rang, and Goddard's able to turn it around not, again. Not surprising at all. This is spilled back to the outside. This is a blood feud, ladies and gentlemen. Look at the look in his eyes. Just that glazed the look that almost there's no one home other than a dark entity in Jesse Goddard's right now. I've known Jesse Goddard's for the better part of a decade, and I have never seen this much vitriol spilling out, this much hate oh, raking coming from the Jesse eyes. Goddard's. Ah. Just the jealousy that has fermented inside of Jesse and it turned into something evil and grotesque. And now that dark side being cascaded all over Tony Gunn. Jesse digging that insect's finger into the side of Tony Gunn's eye, trying to pop it out like Stan Hansen did to Vader in Japan. Jesse has officially snapped, ladies and gentlemen. Jesse Goddard's got that Patrick Bateman stare like on, and he's just ready to rip Tony Gunn limb from limb. Don't you besmirch the good name of Patrick Bateman on Jesse Goddard's. Tony Gunn standing tall or trying to throwing his vest into the face of Jesse Goddard. Ooh, Look, got ladies and gentlemen, it's very, very simple, all right? Tony Gunn, one of the, the honest to God, behind the scenes, nicest human beings in OVW, is just being brutalized by someone he thought was a friend. Oh, oh God! But now Jesse Goddard's getting a little brutalization of his own. Well, like he said last week on OVW television, you don't mess. Oh, oh my goodness, spiked him with that DDT. You don't mess with me, I'm not going to mess with you. But Thank by you. God, Jesse Goddard, he has messed with Tony Gunn, and now he is feeling the consequences. Josh, to your point, I've known Tony Gunn in years, one of my best friends in the world. I've never seen him as irate as he has been these last couple days, wanting to rip Jesse Goddard's limb from limb, flesh from flesh. I mean, you saw the, 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 the videos on social media, the, the, the vitriol between these two, the harsh words, but now Jesse Goddard's taking things to a whole other level with that backstage attack on Tony Gunn. Jesse Gunn, uh, Jesse Goddard's, excuse me, has taken this so much further than he ever should have. Jesse Goddard's being so jealous 
claiming that Tony Gunn is, is, is trying to take opportunities from him, trying to take food off of his family's table, when all Gunn has been trying to do is climb the ranks. I mean, Josh, you, you saw they were in the same match, that same key to opportunity matchup. They both had the same opportunity to win. Tony Gunn came out on top, and Goddard just cannot stand it. But Jesse's very existence is around having that National Heavyweight Championship. Any opportunities taken away from him are undeserved, he feels, by anybody else. Well, Steven, to your point, I think Jesse Goddard thinks that he has defined no matter what championship he has. Look at this. Just break it down to look a at the hate. Look at those southpaws. Jesus. Tony Gunn just punching his lights out. Tony Gunn throwing left hands like this is an Arkansas bar fight. Goddard's got a million dollar smile. Oh, oh God, what a spear. Goddard's with that spear. Goddard's with that spear. He is known to use that to soften his opponents up. Is he's he going to be able to capitalize? With that spear. Here we go. This that might it. be this it. This is it. Gunn. Oh. That might be the first man to ever kick out of Jesse Goddard's spear. Goddard cannot believe it. This OVW Arena cannot believe it. Absolutely shocked. Tony Gunn doesn't look, I mean, he might not have anything left. Well, Tony Gunn, w I, here's the thing. If I know Tony like I know Tony, he will fight tooth and nail to do everything he can to give Jesse Goddard's back a receipt for everything Goddard's has done to him. Jesse yeah. looks like he's trying to humiliate Tony here. Josh, you point, you're not wrong. Tony Gunn, a medical anomaly, a heart bigger than his entire body somehow. But he's going to have to have more than heart tonight to get through. The face that runs the place, Peck Daddy, Pectacular, whatever the hell you want to call him, but tonight I'm calling him deplorable. Well, Tony Gunn is going to try to rearrange the face that runs this place before it's all said and done. I don't know. Tony Gunn might end up looking like a Picasso. By the time this one's done, Jesse Goddard's ripping and clawing at the face of Tony Gunn. Yeah. Jesse Goddard's laying into Tony Gunn, and you're not going to see that million-dollar oh. smile tonight, but you got to think Tony Gunn wanting to take it down to at least a $50,000 smile after some just, southpaws. Just the disrespect. The disrespect of not only the ring, but his opponent. Jesse Goddard's is blowing his nose. Jesse Goddard's respects one thing and one thing only, and that is Jesse Goddard. You're not wrong. Jesse Goddard's an island onto himself, especially here at OVW as of late. As of late? This crowd trying to cheer Tony back on, but how much damage has Tony Gunn taken? Well, and here's the thing. Here's the thing. Look at Tony's face. Tony is getting livid. Hold on. Tony doesn't care what Jesse does. He's got to be shut down to stop. Tony, Tony firing up here. Jesse got his back and down. Jesse's stunned. Oh, Jesse's begging off is what he's doing, and Tony's having none of it. Oh. oh. Hold on. Oh, Tony Jesse. is so pissed off. He doesn't care. Jesse All he's he, doing is making it matter. Jesse thought it was just smart, but no. Tony got him now, turning it around. He just yep. fired up. He's shooting out of both barrels. You got to get out of Dodge. Spectacular. You're about to take some buckshot. L lighting Ooh. up. Jesse, strike after strike. Chop, then punch. Tony Gunn charging Jesse in the corner. Clothesline keeps him in place. Where is he getting these reserves? Where is he getting the rest of this gas? Tony Gunn has taken so much damage, but finding something somewhere to take it to Goddard's right now. Huge locomotive clotheslines. Does he have one more in him? Got this hang blood feud is boiling over. Oh. oh, Tony taking a little bit too much time there, trying to build up a little bit momentum, and Jesse Goddard's cutting him off with a short elbow. Hold what? on. Gunn's got him up, drives his man back into the buckle. Runs him all the way back across the ring and now driving his shoulders into the midsection. Shoulders into the ribs like a shotgun. Tony Gunn not backing down. I see what you did there. Gunn, though, has taken so much damage. Even when he takes it to Goddard, you can see, he has to grab those ribs after so many shots. That shot to the chair to even kick the night off. Tony dragging him up by his ears from the canvas. And now just positioning Jesse Goddard on that top Ooh, turnbuckle. You guys, in this match, you have to believe these two spent so much time together, traveled together, know each other so well. They're going to have to go outside of their normal wheelhouse to pick up a win here. But honestly, I don't think winning's on their mind so much as it is inflicting damage on someone that you feel is wrong. This is a grudge match, Brian. All they're looking to do is inflict damage. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Goddard's so loopy here. He's almost falling off that top turnbuckle. Gun going up to that, that high risk district. Gun may look to help him getting off that turnbuckle in his own way here. I can't tell. Gun looks like he's looking for a superplex. I thought he might be trying to go for an avalanche DDT for a moment. Well, trying to get Goddard. Goddard's holding on desperately. Hold on. 
Goddard's being drugged all the way up to the top. Gunn looks like he's, he's losing his footing. Goddard's able to fight out of it. Knows he was in a precarious situation. Oh, oh clapping the ears, disorienting Gunn. Oh, God. sunset God. flip power bomb from the top. Tony Gunn limp now. Not a, this, oh my God, I think both of these men, this looks like a car wreck out here, guy. Good Lord, Tony Gunn's eyes are shut. He might not be awake right now. And if he is, he does not know where he is. I am sure. Goddard's. Jesse Goddard's trying to roll himself over. Look at this. Goddard just beating the bullets off of Gunn here. And that might be it. Oh. Oh, look at Goddard's. Look at the eyes on Jesse Goddard's. He can't believe it. He cannot believe that Tony Gunn was able to kick out. I don't think this capacity crowd can believe it. You don't really don't see something like that without the bell ringing. The spear didn't work. The top row power bomb didn't work. Oh, hang on. Jesse, Jesse Goddard's is livid. He is seething in the center of the ring right now. Every breath just making him angry. The rage filled Mr. Pectacular. Oh my. Kill oh, shot. Kill shot. Kill shot. Where the hell did that come from? Kill shot out of nowhere by Gunn. But does he have enough to recover? Can he get the pin? Tony, get over there. Drape an arm. Do something. And that veteran ring awareness that Goddard's reaching for the ropes on the way down. But now you got to ask, can either man get up? Will either man, after the beating they've taken, be able to make it to their feet? If neither man's able to get up, this will be a double count out, and the match will be considered a draw. Neither one of these men want that to happen. They want a definitive answer. Tony somehow dragging himself to his feet. Goddard's up to what? That's, that's no somehow. That is being powered by rage. Gun now. Coming out of the corner for a third time. Close oh. line. Almost decapitating spectacular. Where is Tony fighting it? I will tell you, rage is a greater motivator. Hate is a greater motivator than damn near anything on the planet. You're seeing it in action right here. That's true, and Tony Gunn just stomping a mud hole in Jesse Goddard's right now. Goddard's trying, uh, Gunn trying to get himself under control here. Doesn't want to make a mistake, but Goddard's trying to beg off again. This match is not in no, uh, Sorry, this match is not no disqualification. Tony Gunn starting to center himself a little bit. The professionalism of Shoney, Tony Gunn showing through as he tries to, to make sure that he can continue to inflict this amount of punishment on Jesse Goddard without getting himself disqualified. Okay, you see the anger though again, just too much for Tony Gunn to contain. Can I, I, I don't know if he can contain it. What, what, what the hell is Goddard doing? What, what is Jesse got? got oh, Jesse's got a chain. Come on, Jesse. Jesse just pulled a chain out of his boot. If all that, else fails, break out the hardware. Had that concealed weapon in his boots. Referee distracted by Tony Gunn. Wait, wait, wait. Oh! oh! Referee out of position. Didn't see the shot to the jaw. Shot to the jaw with that steel chain. No. Why, what the hell? Are you freaking kidding me? What a piece of trash. Not like Your this. Your winner of this match, Jesse Gunn. What a piece of garbage, Jesse Goddard. And look at that. Goddard's getting out of Dodge. Goddard's understanding that when Tony gets up, by God, there will be hell to pay. Tony Gunn laid out, has no idea what just happened. Didn't see that steel chain, but neither did the referee. That allowed Jesse Goddard to pick up the win in this blood feud. That right hand wrapped the chain was right on the button. That flash knockout put Gunn down. I don't know if Tony knows where he is, but this is far from over.